Hi, it's Dave from Strider Software, and I'm going to show how easy it is to add pictures to your media browser and use them as fills in TypeStyler. Before we work with the images, I'll make a design using a headline text object. When I click and hold on the headline text tool, I see the available ready-made shapes. I'll choose a vertical arc with a flat top and grow my text object. Remember, these shapes are just starting points and can always be edited. I'll type Pepe and then click outside to accept. Now below the text I'd like a matching panel shape, so I click and hold the mouse down on the rectangle panel tool in the tool palette. I'll select a flat bottom with a dome top. I'll then click and drag my panel to create the shape I'd like right underneath my text object. I'll select both items. From style, we'll choose white with soft shadow. From the toolbar, I'll click on the media browser icon. It's easy to add custom images to the media browser. You can drop folders into it from elsewhere on your system or from an external drive. I'll select the folders tab. To drop an image from my desktop, I'll just slide my type style document over, find the folder I would like, and drop it into the folders area. Another way of getting images into the media browser is to press the control key while clicking in the folders area. Click on add custom folders, find the folder you'd like, select it, and click add. Now I'll show how easy it is to add an image as a fill. I've got my panel selected, let's find the image I would like, and simply drag it on. Another way to use an image as a fill is using the custom image drop well within the style workshop. So I'll select my text object, find an image I would like, and drag it into the custom drop well. But what I really want to do is have a separate image in each letter of Pepe's name. Well, this is easy. I'll just click on Type Setting, click on Fill Series, scroll down, select Image Letter Series, and you'll see each character is filled with our default images. Each one of these little boxes is also a drop well. So I can take images and drop it into each one. And just that easy, it's done.